here we are everyone welcome back to operation anderson the first one of fifa 20 and hopefully it's gonna last a lot longer than it did last year uh so just this screen here it's not much use in this episode is it because we haven't played any games we don't have a top scorer we haven't moved division we're starting in division 8 by the way but as you can see our top rated player is going to be felipe anderson to start off with of course so what i'm going to talk about at the start is actually the rules so the first thing we're going to talk about is how we get players it's the same as last year filters are the way to go so if I win the game by two goals, it is on goal difference. That's how many filters I'll be able to pick on the transfer markets. That may be like gold and Brazilian or gold and Premier League, depending on what I want. It might not even have to link to Anderson if it's on the other side or whatever. Um, yeah, the amount we can spend on our players is also dictated by division. And so how many points you've got in your division. So if we're on like 450 and we're in Div 8, we get a lower budget of 1k. If we move up to Div 7, we'll get 2k and so on. That's how it works. And how many players we get to pick from. This is where Anderson comes in. So if I score with Anderson, assist with Anderson, or he gets man of the match, I get to pick an extra player. Not in the fact that I get to put more than one player in my team. From the filter... I get to pick more than just the first player. So if Anderson scores twice and gets an assist, that would be three extra players. So I pick from the first four, the one I think fits my team best. So Anderson scoring, Anderson assisting, it's helpful. So I'm just going to show you the team now and then we'll get into the match. So here's the team that is going to be starting off Operation Anderson. It's basically just a starter team with Felipe Anderson in it. 4-3-3 formation. Bronze goalie, whole bronze back line. Midfielders aren't brilliant either, but we have got the Cockney and Iniesta, Mark Noble marshalling that area. Have some random bloke on the right wing. Jay Rodriguez is another gold up front. And finally, we have the main man, Felipe Anderson. So just three golds in the starting team, mostly bronzes. And that is why we've got to win games early on to try and get ourselves some better players. Right. Our first opponent has got a very, very pacey front line. This isn't what we want to start against. Eric Bailly, solid at the back as well. Fred. Ashley Young is maybe someone that we could target. He's going to be up against Felipe Anderson. So I hope that goes all right. But that front three, it's scary. Right, and we are going to have the first touch of the series. It will be Jay Rodriguez who gets us underway for the first time on Operation Anderson. By playing it to wing, who's going to give it back to him? Could we get a goal? From kickoff in the first game. It's actually becoming more likely. Rodriguez comes forward. We're going to get a shot off already. I had to shoot. Come on, guys. Wasn't anywhere near. Alright, here's Mark Noble. The engine in the middle of the park. Against Fred. Who is meant to be their engine in the middle of the park. Mark Noble is just better than Fred. I mean, there's no arguing that. Mark Noble to Rodriguez. Let's try and dig the goalie, maybe. It's off the bar. So close to our first goal of the series. Oh, he's played a nice ball over there to start. We've done well that time, but we can't keep letting that happen because if he gets anywhere near in front of our man, it won't be good. But that is beautiful for Anderson. On he goes. Round his man, he's going to win us a free kick. Kind of near the edge of the box. Cabasadi will pick up a yellow card for that offence as well. I think we need to be looking at this from a crossing perspective. We are just going to whip it into the middle. It's a dreadful cross. But it has actually come back to one of our players. Come on. Second time lucky, maybe. I know headers aren't very good in this game, but Wing could get there. Oh! Oh! Ah, oh, I thought just for a second that the rebound might cross the line if the first one did, and it does remain nil-nil. Oh, Ashley Young just trying to get past Anderson there. He's done very well. Uh, where's he going to go now? All right, Wilson's got space. I don't know if he's going to know. He's just going to run through the middle. This is one-nil. Oh, great save! I was so scared. Then you could just hear I, I was resigned to the fact that goalie wasn't going to save it, and he's pulled out a lovely save here. See, I did move him a little bit, which did help. Just got his hands behind, just managed to push it away there for the corner kick. Right, Noble, where can you go? He's found wing, and he's going to play it one more. Anderson is very, very um, out of the way. That's an absolute horror tackle. And cabasadi has been booked. He's gone. He's gone. He's gone. Haven't had a goal yet, but we've had our first red card for the series, actually. Surprising to see that before we've even seen a goal. Right, here's Milner. Ah, uh, Wilson. I can see someone arriving down the left. He's probably going to use... Oh. oh, that's annoying. Dodgy deflection there. Men arriving in the middle. And the goalie just watches it go past him. And we've conceded the first goal of the series. He does skip it. But he still sweated against me with Callum Wilson. Right, come on guys. We're playing against 10 men. Surely we can get a goal. Wing there. That's exactly what I want to see. Rodriguez. Noble gets on the rebound. for 1-1. Good save. And again, he just can't get on the second ball, unfortunately. But that's promising. 
Right, corner ball. One by Mark Noble. Anderson is going to be the man that whips it into the box. Towards the front post. Ah, oh, why didn't he shoot? That was brilliant ball in uh, by Anderson. The guy was unmarked. I don't know who it was, but they just didn't shoot. They tried to chest it. Let's come back up to Hodgson, though. Rodriguez. Go on, wing. Go on, wing. Oh, good save again. We are really pushing for the equaliser just before half time, though. Anderson to whip the next one in again. It's another kind of decent ball, but it's away. Mellish. Wing. Right in to the depths of added time now. In the first half. Oh, it's a brilliant ball. It's in. Oh, I thought he was I thought he was gonna head it, he didn't head it, so I thought he chanced it, but who scored? It's Jay Rodriguez with our first goal of the series, 1-1 against 10 men. That is where Cabasali would have been standing if we just have a look at this. He's completely shanked it and Fabianski was fooled by it actually. A little bit of a lucky goal, but at least we didn't sweat. So that was the last action of the first half, guys. It's currently 1-1 as you can see on your screen here. We've had a lot of possession, but we need to make it count in the second half and get those goals to get ourselves some better players. Milnar eyes giving it straight to Noble. That's what we love to see. Anderson didn't really make much of an impact in the first half. He's going to do a give and go here. There's space in front of Anderson. Of course, I only have one centre-back on the pitch at the moment. Anderson, he's going to try and curl it. Is that going in? It's off the bar again. How many times have we hit the bar? The rebound. It's off the post again. This is ridiculous. We might have another chance. Anderson's going to go for the spectacular, but no one could run onto it. Easy catch for Fabianski. He's got a wave of it there. All right, Ozil's was going to come out with a the one-two there. Come on, Chris. Get tackled, mate. All right, Chris was just playing a lovely back there to Almiron. They're linking up well on that side. That is a dreadful tackle. Mark Noble is going to have to intervene. And away. All right, Rodriguez picks up a clearance here. He's only got Anderson with him, but that's fine. Uh, if we can just find Anderson, we've got a chance. Rodriguez did not want to pass that, and we've lost the ball. By his only centre back, where well, I remind you, is already on a yellow card. He can end up with no centre backs maybe at the end of the game. All right, Chapman. They've got a lot of men back at the moment, but of course they are missing Cabasali. Nice passes there. Anderson, come on, mate. Get an assist. I can see that man arriving in the middle. Can we find him? All right, he has just slowed down a little bit. It's lagging a bit. We are going to shoot with Anderson. What a goal! Felipe Anderson opens his account with a spectacular finish. If any of you guys are West Ham fans or know about it, very similar to his goal of the season for West Ham against Crystal Palace last season. There is no saving that. Lucas Fabianski, 2-1. All right, he's just carrying out the defence here nicely. Ozil. Uh, he's around his man. That was a very poor tackle. Second time we've missed it again. Oh, he's in here. This is going to be 2-2. Two -two. It's Fred. It's Fred. It's Fred. It's 2-2. Two -two. That is so annoying. Because our goalie isn't very good. I had a few chances to win it back there. And I just couldn't, unfortunately. He has skipped the goal again. Respect to him for that. But we are, unfortunately, back at 2-2. Alright, Fred carrying out of defence now. Fred has actually been very good, unlike real life. Ah, oh, good block there to stop Ozil. No ball. Wing. Alright, we need a bit of support if Jay Rodriguez. Chapman's going to be the man providing it. He's found Jay Rodriguez again. Jay Rodriguez, come on! Oh! He did hit that hard. It's 3-2. Jay Rodriguez. I will skip the goal out of respect, but it was a lovely finish. I would like to watch that again. We are going to respect him because he did skip our goal. So 3-2. We are back leading. Into injury time. Here we go. Go on. Play it to Anderson. He's got time. His men arriving in the middle. Do we go for the other assist? We do. It's wing. Seal the deal. Oh, he's just put it wide, and they have 40 seconds to equalise. Come on. We just need to keep calm to hold on. Do not let An do not let not Hanson Wilson win that header. We didn't. Oh, let's come back out. That should be full time. They should not let this attack go. It's a tackle. Is that full time? It is. We won our first game. Three goals to two. Which means that we literally get to put one filter on. We will get a random goals player to go into our team. But obviously, we check the goals and assists for Anderson. We might have a choice and maybe that could help us get a Premier League player. So we we'll just have a quick look. That is the highlights. That is not what I wanted to go on. We have a look at the player ratings. Anderson did not pick up man in the match. Wing did, so we do not get anything extra there. But Anderson got a goal and no assists, which means we have a choice of two players to pick from. So here you can see me just doing the searches, putting on gold and all of that. I accidentally did search above 1k the first time, which we're not allowed to do at the moment. But I can assure you, when we get better division rival points, we'll be able to search higher. So Gilavogi and Adair, they're the picks for the first player that's going to be added to the team. So just looking at the stats and stuff, neither of them link, which wasn't helpful, but I just thought if it was good of Ogie last year, I might have picked him, but looking at how much slower he is this year, I just fancied Adair 
Adair has got nice stats as well. You can see his pace there is very high. Decent finishing as well, but the big thing that attracted me was his 4 star 4 star. So that means that I can skill people as well. Anson is, of course, basically the only 4 star skill that was in there at the moment. I can also shoot with both feet, which is very helpful when most of your team can't finish. You can see 700 coins there, an absolute snip. And here he is in the actual team, changing to 4 4 2. Anson still on full chem, luckily. That is how we're going to line up for our next match. It definitely does not get any easier. It's actually got a lot harder. Vinicius Jr., Jovic, Inaki Williams. Ah, oh, I'm also at the back. Very quick back line guy as well. This is not looking good help, but he has not got a CDM. That's the thing that I'm banking on. He has no CDM. He has Isco and Thiago as his midfielders. Uh, that ball from the middle is not looking nice. Here's Thiago. Oh, he sweated it across offside, surely? Yeah, that will be ruled out for offside, but that's just shown how defensively vulnerable we can be. Right, here's Wing. I can see Anderson's making a nice little run over there. He's making good progress. We'll keep looking at him, but it doesn't matter because Adair is through. Adair, to give us the lead. Goes for the chip. Scores on his debut. Adair with the goal. Just one through ball. I said it would work for him. It's actually ended up working for us. Adair, he's on through chemistry. Doesn't matter. He's done the goalie there. 1 0 to us. We're going to get back underway here with Jovic. And Isco, just being robbed by Adair. Oh, what form he's in as he ball rolls. His man, Adair. On he goes. Adair, two in two minutes maybe. Just wide. What a game he's having. Adair decided to go short actually. That's interesting. Adair, he's at the heart of everything right now. Adair again. Flicks it over. Rodriguez on the volley. Well saved. Back to Adair. And that is going to be caught by the goalkeeper. Oh, Adair. Stop it. He's working so hard. Rodriguez gets a shot off. It's back to Adair. Is he onside? I don't know. He is. It's 2 0. Adair making such an impact on his debut. What a hero he is. And against this ridiculously good team for this division, we're 2 0 up. It's Anderson. He's the man that we want to get forward. Oh, he sent his man there. On he goes. Philippe Anderson flying forward. I'm going to do the 1 2 just so we can get away from his man. We're going to play it back to him. It's liquid football. Anderson. 3 0. It's a goal for the main man, Philippe Anderson. And three goals. I don't want to be complacent because my players will get tired quicker than his. But this is looking like a win. I'm going to say it. I might have cursed myself there. We might be watching me saying that later at the end. But Anderson has put that out of the goalie's reach. 3-0 and more importantly, a goal for Anderson. Alright, Thiago's carrying that out nicely. And Aki, he's quick. But it doesn't matter. He's been robbed. Oh, here we go. Could just be four. I can see the run. We're going to knock it across. We had to unfortunately a death. Disgusting! For the hat trick. We've got it. I, I, I apologise. I sincerely apologise about that goal. It was just a reflex to knock it to an air. I do apologise, but it is 4 0. Surely now, we're going to have the win. And that is half time, and what a half it has been for our boys. Adair, people would have wondered if he was the right choice, but he's made such an impact, he's got three goals, we're firmly in control of this game. All we've got to do now is hold on while our stamina lows. Alright, his wing. Noble. We're just going to play it between wing and noble. That's all we have to do at the moment. <laughs> Get Rodriguez involved as well. But here carries on wing. Wing. I'm going to try and dink the goalie again. Oh, that's cheeky. That's cheeky. It's 5-0 and that is surely it now. Wing even getting on the score sheet. The silver CM getting amongst the goals. Oh, that's a nice work to Vinicius Jr. We got kind of pulled in getting towards the ball. Vinicius actually struggling to beat his man as easy as I thought he would. He's put the ball across. That's surely going to be a goal. He has got one back. Showing that he's still in the game. If he watches this at 5-1 down, it will be hilarious. But if he actually thinks that highly of himself. He's got one back, though. Vinicius' is pace hurting us. Thiago's found his go. Okay, that could be in for a goal here. Great tackle. Right, Wings picks it up. Rodriguez. Adair. Oh, he's got pace to burn as he goes forward. He's not getting caught. He's not getting caught. Trying to dribble around the goalie. It hasn't worked. Come back to Mark Noble. No, he's going to bury it, surely. Mark Noble into the top corner. 6-1. Surely now. The fight back has been stopped. We are going to win. Diego Costa is going to come on. He has 23 minutes to score five goals. Right, it's going to get us back on the way. It's Karim Benzema. I don't know if he's brought him on. Just playing it around a little bit differently now. Maybe trying to stop conceding while he's 6-1 down. Oh, Mark Noble. Cockney and Niesto. He's done his whole team there. Just bin off your midfielders and get Mark Noble, see? Look at Mark Noble. Wins the corner. Bellish. Nice. One more Anderson. Get there. Oh, he has. That surprised me, actually. Here's Adair. Here's Adair again. Oh, brilliant feet from him. Gets a shot off. Adair is broken. 
Seven one. I don't know how many this man has scored, but it's quite a few now. Seven one. Let's just carry on racking up the gold. I think we're actually going to get to pick our player here that's under 1k. Brilliant. Oh, Diego Costa's done me there. He's got the shot off. Good save, keeper, actually. Just for a second, I was worried about that going in. Right, here's Rodriguez now. He's got men forward from the corner. But we have given the ball back to him now. Oh, that's a lovely play. Surely he's going to score from this. It's saved. Can we get to the rebound first? Now he's going to get to the rebound first. Surely he's going to score now. Brilliant save again. Get it away. Lovely. Mark Noble's going to try and start a counter-attack now. Rodriguez. Oh, I dare. I dare. Just give him some time off, mate. Oh, he's done the goal. Yeah, it's going to be a penalty. So we need to get the chance to take it with Anderson. I don't know if he's going to card the goalie there. Edair, what an acquisition. Felipe Anderson with a chance to give us another goal now. I do not take penalties very well. Let's just Penenka it and hope that he doesn't stay in the middle. I think he will. No, he hasn't. Cheeky from Felipe. 8-1. You are reading that correctly. We are beating this team 8-1, even though it's much better than us. Felipe overjoyed with his second goal of the game. And I haven't got much else to say. I've already said it's definitely going to be a win. It's just, it's definitely going to be a good play that we're getting because we're probably going to get to pick it now. Oh, we won the ball in his area. Rodriguez, is he on side? He is, wow. I was caught off guard there. I wasn't expecting that to happen. He's playing it around. Is he actually finally going to leave at 9-1? He has. Why has he played that whole time? Went down to 9-1 and then left. I don't know, but we'll have a look at the goals and assists and stuff. Uh, Philippe Hansen, two goals and assists, which means we get to pick from the first four players. But I do believe with the goal margin, there's enough filters for us to pick our own player. On his debut, Adair getting four goals and an assist. What a man. What a victory. And we are now going to see just how many skill points we gain. Hopefully that means we can start closing in on Division 7 for the next game. So yeah, foot chance points going up there as well. Moving very slowly, which is good because we want to build a good team. It's plus 32, which means 22 from our next game, I believe. Which will be next episode, could get us promoted, which means we can get better players, obviously. But now, I'm just going to show you who I've brought to the team, put them in, and then we'll finish up the episode. So we were allowed to pick our player this time, and I knew exactly who I was going for as soon as I knew that I was in charge of picking the player. The filters weren't, it wasn't luck of the draw, and it, it had to be Joe Gomez. We had to get ourselves a stable defender, because that was the only area that was completely bronze. See me here, he is quite rare to get a 1k, but it doesn't matter. If they come up at 1k, it doesn't matter whatever their base price is, whatever it says on footbin, we're allowed to have them. So you just see me here trying my best to get him, so I talk about his stats. He's got over 80 pace and he's a defender. And he's strong as well. You can see me there just missing out on that one, unfortunately. But it ended up all being for the best. You can see here, it's just about to come up. 700 coins. We got him. Minimum price for Joe Gomez. What a steal that is for a centre-back who's literally as good as the ones that cost 30, 40k or even more. So guys, thank you for watching it. This is going to be the end now. I've really enjoyed making this video, editing it. It is good to be back doing another Road to Glory on foot. So if you've enjoyed it as well, Please give it a like down below, comment as well if there's anything you think that I should do, maybe filters I should put on to try and get good players, a certain player that's under 1k that you think would really suit my team, maybe they have good skills or pace or whatever, and yeah, subscribe because there's going to be more episodes of this, I know I said that before, but there will be more episodes of this, you guys will probably pester me for them, so please do that because I want to make more episodes, yeah, and I've just got to say now, thank you for watching, and goodbye.